Hello, join me. Let's solve this China Olympiad exam question. We are asked to solve for a in a to the power of a multiplied by a to the power of a equal to 200. Now, this looks more easier than you think because since a to the power of a and a to the power of a are held by the multiplication sign, that means we can apply the laws of indices. And straightforwardly, we can get to a point in this solution. But that is not the solution. Join me as we find out what the solution to this question will be. Now, to solve this question, as I said earlier on, I want you to recall one law of indices that if you have x to the power of a multiplied by x to the power of p, this can be equal to x to the power of a plus b, right? Now, if I apply that over here, I'm going to have that expression to be 8 to the power of a plus a, and that will be equal to 200. Great. Now, if I simplify this, I'll have that expression to be 8 to the power of 2a, right? Equal to 200. Now, can 200 be broken to a factor such that we have 8 as the base? I don't think that is possible because 200 cannot be broken down to 8 to the power of whatever. So what we are going to work out well or what we are going to use in solving this question is definitely the laws of logarithm or the laws of natural logarithm. I prefer working with the laws of logarithm. So if we take the log of both sides, we'll have the log of 8 to the power of 2a equal to the log of 200, right? And that expression according to the law of a log written. this will come over here to multiply the log and then we'll have 2a multiplying the log of 8 right and this will be equal to the log of 200 well simplified now if I divide here by the log of 8 and equally divide here by the log of 8 I'm going to have that expression to cancel out log of 8 cancelling out log of 8 and then I'll be left with 2a to be equal to the log of 200 divided by the log of 8. Now what do we do from here? Now as a matter of fact, I want to make sure that I break down log of 200 such that I have one given value involving uh, 8. So the factor of 200 that can give me 8 is uh, if I divide uh, 200 by 8, I'm going to get 25. So that means 8 times 25 can give me 200. So that expression can now give me 2a equal to the log of 8 multiplied by 25, right? And all of these will be divided by the log of 8. Great. Now from that expression, I can simplify that expression further to uh, using the multiplication law of logarithm I have that expression to give me 2a equal to log of log of 8 divided by log of 8, right? And this will be uh, plus the log of 25 can give me 5 to the power of 2, right? And that will be divided by the log of 8. 
as we move ahead you can see that the log of 8 can cancel out the log of 8 and so I'll be left with 1 there so I'll have 2a equal to 1 plus while this comes this way right that's going to give me 2 log 2 log 5 divided by the log of this can also simply be broken down to give me 2 to the power of 3 right good so if we simplify that we're going to have 2a to be equal to 1 plus while this give me 2 log of 5 this other one can give me 3 log of 2 so if I simplify that expression I'll gradually be getting the solution to that question so this is going to give me 2a equal to 1 plus this is now going to give me 2 divided by 3 multiplied by the log of 5 divided by the log of 2. Great. Now I want you to recall that law of logarithm. But before we do that, we want to simplify this expression. If I simplify this expression, I can divide both sides by 2. If I divide both sides by 2, I'm going to have this whole place divided by 2, right? And I'll have this whole place divided by 2. Y2 cancel out 2. I'll be left with A. I'll be left with A to be equal to uh, this law can simply be simplified to 1 plus 2 divided by 3 log of remember this law of logarithm this will give us 5 base what 2 and all of these will be divided by 2 so that seems to be the lowest that can simplify this and that will give me my a to be equal to 1 plus 2 divided by 3 logo and the value of a can be equal to 1 plus 2 divided by 3 log of 5 is 2 divided by 2 what a long expression though this can still be a simplified but let's check it out to find out if our solution is actually right I'm going to insert this into the original expression given to us. The original expression given to us is 8 to the power of a multiplied by 8 to the power of a will need to be equal to 200 with a equal to this expression. So I have 8 to the power of a multiplied by 8 to the power of a will this be equal to 200. Let's find out. Now, if I simplify this by inserting the power of a, the value of a, I'll have 8 to the power of 8 to the power of uh, 1 plus 2 divided by 3 log 5 is 2. And all of this will be divided by 2, you know that. And this will be multiplied by 8 to the power of 1 plus 2 divided by 3 log of 5 base 2. And all of these will be divided by 2. The question is, are this whole thing going to give me 200? Let's find out. From this expression, since we have... 8 multiplying 8 and they have the same power we can make this to become 8 to the power of 2 right 
right and all of them will be multiplying 1 plus 2 divided by 3 log of 5 is 2 all of these will be divided by 2 now will this be equal to 200 now if we look at that expression very well you come to see that 2 will cancel out 2 and then we'll be left with 8 to the power of 1 plus 2 divided by 3 log of 5 is 2 now with this way expression be equal to 200 at this point we can apply the laws of logarithm of indices remember if you have a to the power of x plus y this can be equal to a to the power of x multiplied by a to the power of y so that expression is going to give us uh, two things that is 8 to the power of 1 multiplying 8 to the power of uh, 2 divided by 3 log of 5 base 2 now will this be equal to 200 now if you look at that very well you come to see that this is going to give us 8 multiplied by this can be equal to 2 to the power of 3 right and this will multiply 2 divided by 3 log of 5 base 2 will this be equal to 200 from this expression you can see that 2 3 will cancel out 3 and then I'll be left with 8 multiplying 2 to the power of 2 log 5 is 2 now can this be equal to 200 now if we simplify that you come to see using the law of logarithm this will be 8 multiplied by 2 to the power of log of 5 to the power of 2 base 2 right will this be equal to 200 now you're going to see from this expression that given the laws of logarithm this 2 is going to cancel out this and then we'll be left with 8 multiplied by 5 to the power of 2 right according to the law of logarithm and this will be equal to 200 will that be possible 5 to the power of 2 is 25 so we'll have 8 multiplied by 25 8 multiplied by 25 will it give us 200 of course yes 8 multiplied by 25 will give us 200 so 200 is equal to 200 so that tells us that the value of a equal to 1 plus 2 divided by 3 log of log of 5 log of 5 is 2 all divided by 2 is the solution that satisfies that mathematical expression given to us up there so you see very easy i know you did enjoy watching this math solution don't forget to give it a thumbs up share it with friends and colleagues and remember to subscribe to my channel for more simplified mass content. Thanks so much for watching and see you next time.